Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. I'm starting over here at the title screen because I'm resuming my save file and I'd like to show you something. First a tip, when you're making a walkthrough, never ever I just have one save file. Copy your save files along the way. Got it? Good. Okay, <laughs> so now I got a choice. I'm gonna start from the Sanctuary, because you know where Link's house is. Yep, the Sanctuary is this place where Zelda can easily be found. And <laughs> I'm just gonna go and follow the path over to the left. Hopefully getting 130 rupees along the way. You'll see why. See, this X marks the spot. I could go over to this side right here, but... You know, I mean, I I'll humor the game by going over to this side, even though I know I'm supposed to go over to this side later. <laughs> the reason why I want to humor the game is because I want to get some stuff, and ah, and to get some stuff I need to go and get that stuff, and that stuff is on this side. By the way, if you need to grind for rupees, this place is a pretty nice place to grind for rupees, as well as getting bees! Ah, bee, bee, ah, bee. You are in impossible to hit. Okay, nearly impossible to hit. <laughs> I don't know why, but that's what bees do. Uh, hey, let's go. Yep. Yep. Aha! Two for the price of one. And Kakariko Village. That's a place that I'm going to. Uh, wait, hold on a sec. Hold on. Yeah! Who needs that sign? <laughs> I am going to f keep following this path here. And. Yep, and then I'm gonna go south after I go in this place. <laughs> You'll see why in a second here. This is why I want 130 rupees. Hmm, look like you might have an interesting destiny. May I tell your fortune? I'll make it cheap. <laughs> sure! I just wanted to show you that this is the place that'll sort of give you kind of hints about where you need to go. This is a total waste of, uh, wait, what, 15 rupees? Sometimes. Oh yeah, I guess charges differently, I forgot about that. Okay, so I guess I don't need as many rupees as I thought. <laughs> Alrighty, that's fine by me. And uh, by the way, Kukos, never, ever, and I mean ever, disturb them. You have been warned. Alright, so here we are in Kakariko Village, the music is nice. It is calming. Oh, so calming. Ah, I've had enough of this place, I'm going north. <laughs> I want to go over to the Lost Woods here because there is a certain stop. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> There's a certain stop. Da, 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 da. There's a certain thing that I'm looking for in here that I believe I can get right now. Uh, we shall see in just a second here. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Mmm, delicious rupee. And that's not what I'm looking for, actually. I'm looking for... Oh, not thieves. Thieves. You guys are annoying. Eh. They're invincible, and they steal your rupees if they grab you, by the way. This is it, the Master Sword! Oh, no, no, can't be it. Well, you can actually throw it at things. <laughs> Out of my way. Stop it! No! Bad! Bad! No, mo no stealing rupees from me. They're completely invincible. If they bump into you, they will rob you blind of stuff. And yeah, no, wait, this isn't it just yet. That isn't it just yet. Hold on, where is the patch of grass that I am looking for in specific? Ah, I could pick up this right away. This is a mushroom, and mm, this is not gonna make my pocket smell very nice. <laughs> Whoops, why did I do that? Uh, let's see here, where is the spot? The spot be a spot. Uh, this is the exit spot that I'm- Ah, here it is, here it is, here it is. Fall down here, and... Go around, yo- Oh wait, there it is. It's a collect four of them, it'll increase your life just as a full heart container would. Now going around here, hey, how's it going? Hey kid, this is a secret hideout for a gang of thieves. Don't enter without permission. By the way, I heard that one of our ex-members is staying at the entrance of the desert. Interesting. So I will keep that in mind. Alright, so that's our exit. And I'm not gonna explore the rest of this. Uh, uh, no, no, stop it. Ah, you got it. <laughs> Whatever. But I'm not gonna explore the rest of this forest because that's really the only thing that I can get here now, you know, with the mushroom. Did I just walk? 
Right through that hoarder? What? It's supposed to hurt you when you touch it. <laughs> okay. And wait a second. Wait a second. Okay. <laughs> it's back. I thought I already plucked that. <laughs> anyway, I just want to go back outside and avoid the crows. I'm lagging a lot here for some reason. I did disable Windows Arrow, so it's just got to be a emulator issue thing. Never play on emulators if you can help it, really. Just never, never as accurate as the actual console. Alright, let's plop down here. Yeah, there we go. Now I can begin to explore the village for realsies, which won't take too long to explore, really. There's not too many people to chat with. And what I'm going to do here to start out is hop right down here. <laughs> yeah, it's another hole that you can fall in. It's like a well-type place. I'm going to open this. I get bombs! Which I will immediately switch to. Because, look at this suspicious wall. Remember that I was telling you about if you hold your sword out? You can get that weird sound. Plop a bomb there. I'm gonna explore these chests here while that bomb explodes. Yeah! Pocket change! Lots and lots of pocket change! And over here, this is a very nice reward. You most certainly want to come in here because there's another piece of heart waiting for you. How do you like those apples? Mmm! <laughs> Alright, let's hop down here and go out this way. Now, remember that cave that we seen before we jumped in the hole from the upper place? Yep, that's the cave. <laughs> and what? Uh-oh. No, 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 it wasn't me, I swear! <laughs> what is this? I'm, I'm just, wh why? Why would they do this to me? Hmm. Yo, Link, this house used to be a hideout for a gang of thieves. What was their leader's name? Oh yeah, his name was Blind, he hated bright light a lot. Keep that in mind for something really, really later in the game. I'm talking like... Dungeon 6 later. <laughs> So now we got a little puzzle here, um, I, I think you can get all these at once, but it is possible to screw this up and you have to re restart the room by, uh, um, by, yeah, uh, hold on, hold on, hold on, I think I got this, I got this, yeah, but yeah, if you, if you mess this up, just restart the room by, uh, uh, leaving the, via the stairs and then come back down here, but that's not all, oh no, <laughs> oh yeah. And see what's inside this chest. Another heart piece! Man, we are just collecting them left and right here, aren't we? <laughs> you see, it's worth going through places and clearing them out because you will find quite a bit of benefits along the way to uh, a floundering gamer, I guess you could say. Like, if you mess up a lot, you have the, the health to back it up. Alright, this is the house that I was looking for with X marks the spot, so let's chat with some I don't know how to pronounce the name. Who? Oh, it's you, Link. What can I do for you, young man? The Elder? Oh, I haven't seen him since the wizard began collecting victims. What? Master Sword? Well, I don't remember the details exactly, but long ago, a prosperous people known as the Hylia inhabited this land. Legends tell of many treasures that Hylia hid throughout the land. Like heart pieces? <laughs> the Master Sword, a mighty blade forged against those with evil hearts, is one of them. People say that it now is sleeping deep in the forest. Yeah, I got it. Alright, so, okay, so this wasn't the person I was looking for, but it is a lead. Let's continue, shall we? You know, exploring. <laughs> I'm just gonna sort of like zigzag left to right and top to bottom sort of thing. Uh, so I'm gonna go around this way. There really isn't anything that you can do in this particular area that much too much. I mean, yeah, there is, but what I mean is that there isn't... Like, like that, did you see that stuff, that thing that you could hammer there? I mean, that stake that, yeah, you can't really do anything about that now. By the way, there's a picture of Mario on some walls. A <laughs> little bitty reference. And, uh, this is interesting right here. Listen to this. Hey, here's Link, the Waterman soldiers, anyone come quickly! <laughs> and everyone outside goes back in the house when this sort of thing happens. So, what you gotta do to reset that, if you would like to, because they lock their doors, is, uh, go out of the village. Come back in, everything's back to normal. 
<laughs> in, in fact, that uh, lady that panicked when she talked to you, she's, she's right back there. She just didn't let me pass this time. <laughs> Alright, so we got a wind vane here. This is something nice for the future, and this is why I wanted a hundred more rupees. You, sir, have you been going through life with a one of my hold anything bottles? Well, step up. Step right up and make your life complete. I've got one on sale now for the low, low price of 100 rupees. You bet I am. Goodbye, thanks a lot. Now hold it up above your head for the whole world to see, okay? It's good for business. <laughs> it's, just, it's picking fun at the whole hold things above your head thing. And by the way, as useless as it may sound to have a something that someone would throw away, this bottle is actually incredibly useful. Trust me on this. You'll see later. All right, so this is that lady's house, and wow, what are you doing there? Oh no, no, no! Don't, don't, don't disturb the cuckoo. Just have a good day. Okay, we're we're okay. Don't talk to the lady. She's just gonna call a guard. <laughs> Lots of grass to cut if you'd like, I suppose. This one trusts you, though. Oh, Link. The rumors say you kidnapped the princess, but I still trust you. That's nice of you. So over here, you notice that there's a, a like on the outside here. There's a little side house attached to this thing. Well, what you want to do here is uh, go inside. Don't, don't disturb the cuckoo. In fact, I'm going to move you out of the way. You too. Oh, geez. Okay, we're good. <laughs> oh, geez. They're everywhere. <sighs> yeah, just calm, calm yourself. They haven't, they haven't rampaged. Yeah, it's just a little secret place to get some arrows for something you don't have right now. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. You got other stuff to explore. This person is totally scared of you. <laughs> I'm gonna go up here into this house now. Oh, poor kid. He's sick. I can't go out because I'm sick. <coughs> People say I caught this cold from the evil air. It's coming down the mountain. <laughs> this is my bug catching net. I'll use it when I'm better. But for now, I'll lend it to you. <laughs> this is all an awesome item. You'll see why later. <laughs> you can catch stuff with it, obviously, but you can catch more than just bugs, let me just say that. Alright, so now that we got the bug catching nuts, let's go south into this secret area, which we'd only be able to tell as possibly exists from the other side, but since I know it exists, I can go here ahead of time. Here's bottle number two! <laughs> oh, oh no, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <sighs> oh, okay, we're, we're okay. Everything's everything's fine, but oh, this guy's got to cut his lawn. This is terrible. Uh, okay, so how's this guy going? Hi, Link. Sorry about my yard. It's a little overgrown. <laughs> Thanks for visiting. I'm glad to have company to talk to you. I will tell you an interesting story. There's a lake swimming with Zoras at the source of the river, but it is hard to find. The treasure of Zora can turn people into fish. <laughs> I'd love to see that. Me too. Me too. Perhaps one day we will too. Okay, we will. And what's this? No, no, we don't need that. <laughs> uh, let's go into the tavern here and see what people are doing. Uh, my son really liked to play the flute, but he went to look for the golden power and has not returned. I wonder where he is and what he's doing now. <sighs> Here's our lead. Oh, I saw her. A very nice lady at the waterfall of wishing in the hills where the river begins. I think you should... Oh, this isn't my lead. I'm looking for a different person, actually. <laughs> I thought that the lead that I'm looking for was here, but no, I'm mistaken. I'm mistaken, even though I know where to go, but yeah. <laughs> uh, let's go in the cuckoo shack here. Just because? No, nah, it's not really a cuckoo shack. Uh, this will recover your health. This recovers health, too, and this is a bomb refill. It's the price of those in rupees, by the way. It's a shop, basically. Uh, so if you'd like to buy stuff, go right on ahead. Hey, Link. Uh, Elder, are you talking about the grandpa? Oh, okay, but I don't to tell anyone the bad people about this. He's hiding in the palace past, past the castle. I'll mark this far on the map. Here you are. So this is my lead. So now we gotta go. Huh. Look at that, right over there, just as I said. <laughs> but that's gonna be a little bit later. Um, actually, I should buy some bombs, because there's another uh, hidden thingabob here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Pick it up with the A button. Yes, I know. <laughs> yeah, you can pick up bombs you already place with the A button. Blah, -dee, blah, blah, blah. I was gonna show that later, but that's good enough for now, as that guy will give you the tutorial. <laughs> And I want to cut my way over to here because oh oh shoot ah oh, fairy ah oh. <laughs> that's that's something 
That's something that I could have used in my bottle. Like, if I were to have uh, used the bug catching net and got it in one of these bottles, if it, it would revive me if I would have the game over. And, yeah. It's a shame. It's such a shame. Okay, let's just get the bombs here. <laughs> so I'm gonna plop the bomb there, because this is actually something secret. And now that we got this open, we have a place to get unlimited bombs. Uh, well, I should say unlimited bomb refills. Watch this, watch this. It's just, if we go inside here, there's there's always gonna be bombs for you to pick up. In fact, I probably should have opened this place up first, the few bombs that I had. Uh, so I wouldn't have had to buy any bombs from the shop, but, well, that's just how things went, I guess. And, uh, I think that is Kakariko Village in a nutshell. So with that, I'm gonna end off the part here. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part when I do a little bit more exploring in this area. Excited? You should be!